Why, hello there. It is fantastic to see you again. Uh, yes, I do know that I promised that we'd be on the Bedrock server uh, this time around, and that would be uh, filming in the single-player world, but instead we're here on the Java server. Why? Well, I've been called over to the shopping district. I'm told there's something very important that I need to see. And we also need to catch up with our good buddy Pixel. So, let's get on with that. Well, I was told I needed to come to the church, so here I am. Now then, what have we got? Beware the false servant. What on earth is that about? The false servant of Karen has claimed credit for the portals. Hmm. This must be resolved. Right. So that's a false servant. What? I'm going to have to do some digging. But whoever... What they're saying is whoever put the portals up wasn't Smitty, and Smitty has taken credit. If this is saying what I think it's saying, and I'm fairly sure I'm right, then I need to be having a word with Karen. And Smitty... Oh dear, Smitty. I don't fancy your chances. But now, I really do need to be meeting up with Pixel. So let's get on to that. Aha, Pixel! Oh, there you hi. are. <laughs> Have you seen this? It is a work of art. Cobbler has outdone himself. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I absolutely love it. Even I popped in from my... To, just to check on the shop and like yeah. everything has changed. I've been gone for like four or five days. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'd spent about uh, a few hours, but probably about a day or so building a um, raid farm. And I came in here, there's a big dragon, <laughs> there's a <laughs> an hourglass, a goat shop, <laughs> and yeah. somebody's, but that wasn't you. The put portals yeah. around the church. No, I was wondering <laughs> about that too. I, I hadn't seen the church and I hadn't seen the portals. The portals are interesting yeah touch. I, wanna, <laughs> I wanna know who did that now i assumed it was you but <laughs> no okay. no all right i'm imagining things <laughs> okay right well i have been sent here because you have made a request i believe yes, you are I, after some farms i need some flower farms and um I hate building them. <laughs> um, maybe, yeah. You, you said you were helping people out. Uh, and I am indeed. Come with me a minute, though, because there is now okay. a requirement. A you requirement. see, uh, I am. Um, I'm not necessarily in control of my actions these days. Uh, I have a new master. I'd be nervous. <laughs> no, a new no, master. not at all. But she has asked that everybody just signs a book. Um, in order okay. to, uh, uh, the, you know, to say what it is they want. So yeah. I have prepared oh, in, a lot of uh, the Church of Karen. <laughs> I bet I do. Hello. <laughs> oh, come I, I, the they've, they've come to worship Karen yeah. uh, in the Karen, church. Karen, you said. Karen, Karen, yes. This is the Church of Karen. Ooh. It might look demonic, but don't let that fool you. Okay. Uh, it's, uh, <laughs> All good and lovely. Um, oh, it's but, already in the book. It's already in the book. You just need to delete unsigned and put your mm. name against it. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, might... Take the book. There we go. Uh, yeah, we are. Yeah. You look good up there. You could be preaching, a, giving a sermon. I could be. <laughs> oh, but look! You've got <laughs> you've got your congregation <laughs> just turned up. <laughs> yeah. All right. <laughs> Very loud, grumpy con Here congregation. <laughs> He's having a dance off over here. <laughs> there we go. What could possibly go wrong? Uh, absolutely nothing, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> Everything will be fine, and Karen will be very pleased. Uh, well, uh, I'm, I'm sure please, <laughs> she won't and her. be calling on you anytime soon. No, and this ominous church has n <laughs> no ramifications ominous, whatsoever. Ominous, no. <laughs> That's just the portals. That wasn't my word. I don't know who did that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we'll get to the bottom. <laughs> All right, yeah, right. let me show you. Okay, um, yep. Where would you like where, them? Where we're going to put them. I'm hearing a spider. 
Uh, I live uh, next to Teeth. I don't know if you've ever actually been over here. Uh, I did briefly, yes. I came over for something from you. I can't remember what. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah. that was early days. Yeah, that was early uh, days. Although Teeth still had a mansion at that point, to be <laughs> yeah. fair. <laughs> He's a... Um, yeah, Teeth's, uh, Teeth's quite the builder. It really is. So yeah. I have um, Sugarcane Farm here. Oh, lovely. I keep 64 blocks. Oh, really? Um, wow. Yep. Cool. So, yeah. yeah, if you AFK here, you'll get uh, about a stack every 30 minutes or so. Oh, all right. Well, that's or 18 minutes, yeah. maybe. Or, yeah, no, so you get about Ooh, two stacks every got 30 the, minutes. you got Wandering Trader. Oh, we don't have many blocks these days. You're not going to sell anything you no, one, is it? No, not yet. No, right. Uh, down here is storage. Ooh. But behind the storage yeah. is 64 cauldrons of lava. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, you have been a busy boy. Yeah, so <laughs> if, you need, uh, if you need lava... Is that for your super smell truck in here above? Uh, no, above you is the collection system for oh, the uh, sugar cane. Yeah, I'm with you. Yeah, we needed to make rockets, and we have a sugarcane oh, farm. Slime head, up. awesome. <laughs> Sorry. Do you want one? I have uh, an extra. If you one. have a slime head, if you have a spare one, yes. I do. Yeah, I would. Love I've just been. Where'd you go? <laughs> I've been running around and just getting rid of them in the uh, swamp. I'm right behind you. Oh, okay. Oh, awesome. Come on, pop it. So, Thank you. But, and then I've been buying heads from Tom to fill out my storage. So. <laughs> um, but the mob yeah. farm up there has a very small sugarcane farm, and it wasn't keeping up with demand. So we got the fish farm here. Oh, yeah, uh, uh, fish farm. Yeah, I had one of yep. them last season. Yeah. Super smelter here. Ooh. 64 uh, furnaces on this one. So Oof. you can do right. it. Dax. What do you Dax, fuel it with? Good. Uh, lava buckets is what I'm Yeah, yeah, that's what I figured. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, and the whole, the whole point of all, well, I'll tell you once right. we're, we're through yeah. the thing, but there's a whole point to all this. <laughs> um, <laughs> right. this is a two tier, so 120, um, wheat farm every growth <laughs> cycle. Wow. <laughs> right. Oh, and you got a floating mob farm up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ethan built that day one yeah, or day two, maybe. Yeah, I remember him saying. In, <laughs> yeah, in here is a semi-auto um, mud farm. Oh, awesome! So it <laughs> yeah. it spits dirt out here, and it spits water bottles out here, and the yeah. water bottles go through. They get cycled through. Yeah. Um, okay. So it just keeps making water bottles and then it just as long as i've got dirt i yeah. keep making mud you can just keep placing and breaking again or whatever it's yeah. like breaking yeah and i got that design from il mango oh um, right is, yeah i haven't yeah. looked at the newer farms yet i need to have a look at what he's done for, his, for the newer stuff <laughs> wow <laughs> you're not gonna want for that anytime soon are you? no 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 <laughs> <laughs> um, I was thinking about maybe putting some kind of fish up there or something for fun, but uh, awesome. nobody would really go up there to see it, I think. No, no. <laughs> that would be a purely for your own amusement sort of job. So it? across the way here, I'm going to yeah. clear out all this dirt. I don't know if you've ever played Skyrim. Skyrim? Yeah, a lot. <laughs> yeah, um, so yeah. as I started building here, I realized uh, this kind of looks a lot like Riften. I could but, see but that. Yeah, yeah. Skyrim. So I'm going to go with that kind of... I'm not going to build Riften, but I'm yeah. going to go with that kind of like aesthetic. Wait, hang on. Riften was that one on the canal that was um, had the Thieves' Guild, wasn't it? Correct. Yes. Yeah, yeah I thought yeah. it was... Yeah, yeah, I remember that one. Yeah. <laughs> so everything's going to be kind of yeah. built over the swamp, and mm. I'm going to clear out the blocks and fill it with water. But then on the other side here, mm -hmm. I'm going to make uh, another kind of similar to the dripstone farm but it's going to be to make clay okay oh right yes i saw you can do that um yeah with yeah, the mud renewable blocks. now yeah with the mud blocks yeah and so between Hence it the will wheat, be the soup. of course i was wondering why do you need such a big yep. wheat farm right the packed mud making uh, yeah <laughs> making packed mud yeah yeah so right. um and then this this will be able to smelt the clay into mm. terracotta and yeah. it'll also be able to smelt the packed mud into mud bricks so Awesome. The server will have a yeah. supply of... Uh, oh, of... I shall be buying that then. I have not played with the new blocks at all, apart from a bit of the mangrove wood. 
Uh, I do yeah, never play with new ones. I've designed a um, a frog like farm uh, in a creative ah. world, but because <laughs> I was just playing around with it, but I haven't right. I haven't built with anything yet. <laughs> so okay. Mm. Well, awesome. I look forward to seeing yeah. what you do. Give me one second to yeah. sleep. And oh, then okay. I'll... Yeah. I carry a bed with but... me everywhere I go, but ah. you go for it. <laughs> I'm, the, a bit, uh... I'm a bit B dubsy about, <laughs> about sleep. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, the terracotta brings me to the flower farms. Yeah. Because I want to be able to provide and have every color the of dyes. flower of, yeah. of dye yeah, for yeah. that. So, okay. Luckily, Good. I am uh, I'm just on the other side. Here we go. Ah, uh, yes, a beautiful flower oh, forest. A flower forest. Wonderful. Yeah. All right. Okay. Good. So, what we need to do is break all of these and then bone meal up the area. So. And find out yeah. what the flower map is, because what happens? Is, oh, you know it. You built these farms before, don't you? Yeah. But uh, <laughs> for those that don't, uh, each area, each chunk or whatever, has a flower map. Um, so it's not what you see here. When you bone meal, you will only yeah. get certain flowers every time, but it does not equate to the ones that are already there. So what you right. do is you strip out all the flowers and then bone meal and find out what is where, and then you can work out where to put your farms. Mm. Yep. Right. And uh, that was the frustrating part for me last season. I built one, and then I was like, um, yeah, nope. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> Don't want to build another two or three to get everyone. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. We can um, sort that out easily enough. Have you got a bone meal source? Oh, you've got a mob farm up there. Yeah, right. Okay. I've got the mob farm. You yeah. can use that. Um, I've oh, got I've more got plenty. bone. I'm just checking a few. Oh, okay. uh, it, I can stock it up first time, but to keep it running uh, is what I was yeah. thinking. Yeah. Um, to keep it running, when you're done building the flower farms, mm -hmm. I'm going to come in here. Unless you really want to build that too, I'm going to come in here and build a uh, moss. Oh, bone you said farm. moss farm. Yeah. Uh, no, yeah. no, no. I'll let, I'll let you build that one. Thank you. <laughs> I've got a backlog of farms to be building. Uh, yeah, <laughs> Karen is a demanding mistress. Okay, cool. All I right, shall yeah. um, come back with some stuff. I forgot to bring bone meal with me. Um, and go around here and see where the best places are. And then Great. Uh, I appreciate get building. It. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. Give me a yeah, day, and, day uh, or two and it should be up and running. Oh, yeah. No <laughs> rush. I've still got stuff to build over there before I really <laughs> use these farms. So Cool. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm yeah, going to want, want, uh, want some ties as well because it's a... Uh, the concrete particularly i'm after right then in which case i shall nip off and uh come back to you in a bit <laughs> awesome thank Cheers. you very much thanks buddy Later. bye you bet bye well that's three flower farms built i wasn't going to put you through the pain of watching me do it um they are the designs from logical geek boy i'm a big fan of his he's quite possibly my favorite creator on youtube uh, and they run perfectly um, I did mess up a, a few of the locations, so I'm probably going to have to make another one to make sure we uh, capture enough of the blues um, and another or, or, and oranges. Uh, they were the two that I forgot. Um, so we've got a little bit of both, but not a huge amount. Uh, but three will do for now. Uh, I also need to put in a auto sorter. As you can see, you get a lot of these. I'd like to filter them into composters uh, as much as possible. Um, but you get a good amount of flowers as well. Um, and I also like to put the water on a timer. Really, it's not that AFKable at the moment. Uh, as it is, you've got to turn it on and off again. Um, and I really would like this to be something that you just make sure you put enough bone meal into the lot of it um, and it works. But if I just show you one of them over here, for example, if we get going, oh, don't know what happened there. As you can see, it's throwing up the flowers. Now, they'll keep going for a bit. This should be the occasional one that's not pink come up. Uh, it's not happening at the moment, no. All right, so that will do. Oh, yep, yeah, we've got some blues over in the corner. So if I flip the switch now, water comes and pushes them all down into the hoppers, which bring them along and down into the chest. As you can see, we get the occasional blue orchid, but not really many of them. Uh, so it's uh, the, the, the light blues and the oranges I need to recapture. Um, but I'll do that in between episodes and put on the auto sorters and timers and what have you, uh, just to improve everything uh, along here. But um, I think that's at least enough to justify having put Pixel into a life of servitude. I am very sorry, Pixel. 
Oh dear me. Right then. Next thing, I have a build in mind, which means heading on back to the shopping district. So, back off we go. Well, I'd been gone from the server for about a, a day or so, and a lot has changed. Oh my goodness. We have ourselves a pink spider sheep, I believe. Ringo is in the process of coming up with a name for that one. Um, we have ourselves uh, the hourglass I didn't get a proper look at before. Set in sand and glass. We have a sun. Because of course we have a sun. Let's get a better look at that. <laughs> That's awesome. Really, really awesome. Uh, the a dragon is now complete. Uh, yes, here we are. Let's have a quick look from down here. Oh my goodness, look at that. That is super cool. Let's go have a quick look inside. Wait, what was this? Jess started... Oh, yeah, uh, Jess is uh, going to be coming back on. She's the server owner. Uh, wow. Look at this place. Oh, I love it. Misfit warriors. Not warrior. That's me. You're calling me a servant. How dare you? I presume the egg is going up there. And we have some more heads around the place. Pixel and the almighty cobbler. Clob cobbler being the one who designed and made this. And he's done amazing work. Wow. I am in awe uh, of this. Uh, but that is not all. We have ourselves... Some sort of flower beast. I've got no idea who have done some of these things. Uh, Ringo, I know, did the spider sheep. Uh, not sure. I think Teeth might have done the sun. I've got no idea who did this. Let's have a look up here. Oh, can we get in its mouth? Oh, no, it's flush. Right, okay, I'm going to have to try flying. Okay. Boosh. Out. Okay, it's solid, but we've got that in there. Oh, cool. Well, I love it, whoever did that. Let's see if we can just take a quick look around. That wasn't good flying. Let's try that again. Oh, wow. Well, well done, <laughs> whoever made it. Oh, hang on, we've got some people gathering over here. And let's have a quick hang on. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, somebody has been pranking it. It's, all, it's even on the roof. <laughs> oh dear. I think Karen might be talking to you, Smitty. I think she'd like a word. You really shouldn't have done it. Oh dear me. And then if we head on over to our church, it seems that somebody has gone and... Uh, been a little bit more dramatic. Uh, I don't know if this is Karen's doing. The false servant must pay. They've gone and made a graveyard with a rip to hoop. Oh, sorry, buddy. Uh, we have, yeah, blood stains coming all around here. Uh, and then if we head on inside, we have Beware the False Servant. The False Servant must pay. Oob must pay. Oh dear Oob, oh dear Smitty, you are in a world of trouble. Yeah, sorry about that, uh, but I need to have a word with Karen and see what her decision is. So, I want to talk to my manager. Hi Karen, uh, why am I in a hole? Because, because you, you need, need to know, know your place. I summon you. Not you summon me. Look, it's important. Last time we spoke, you mentioned that Smitty had done the nether portals around the church. But uh, some evidence has come to my attention that he might not be on the level with that. I don't think that he did it. Then you mean it was another one of my servants and not Smitty? He's lying to me. It would seem that way, yes. That's it. I need to be able to see the overworld properly. You must find me a way to see through into the overworld. Of course, Dark Lady. Do not kill him yet. I need to investigate. He might be working for one of the other Dark Lords. The other? D 
dark lords? Yes, the other lords who were banished here with me when the lords of light threw us from the overworld. But those lords have gone from the overworld now, and we have fighting amongst ourselves to get back. Right, well, I obviously stay your humble and loyal servant, uh, Karen. Uh, I'll get on with designing that uh, way of you looking into the overworld now. Leave it with me. Well, hurry up about it. If the other Dark Lords are doing stuff in the overworld with their minions, I must know. Right, now go away. I need to talk to my spy master. Well, that was certainly an interesting meeting. So there are other Dark Lords. Hmm. I'll file that away under interesting for now. And, uh, oh look, we've got a new horse shop on the server. Hello, everybody. But either way, the build I was going to do in the uh, shopping district is, uh... It's going to have to be a bit bigger. If I'm going to get Karen to be able to see in, I'm going to have to do something a little bit more impressive than I originally planned. Uh, we'll have to think on that and come back to it on the next episode. What to do, what to do. But, oh my goodness, I mean, looking from here, the shopping district. Oh, I love that potion shop, by the way. Another one or two spills. Uh, yeah, the shopping district is looking fantastic. I absolutely love it. Ah, oh, wow. Right, okay, well that'll do for this episode. Um, so, as always, like if you like, subscribe if you haven't, and uh, yeah, I'll catch you in the next episode where, whether it's Bedrock or not, um, we'll definitely be doing some interesting builds. Catch you in the next one. Bye! <laughs> I forgot to say during the video, uh, Pixel is also a YouTuber, and it would mean a lot if you went and checked out his channel and maybe dropped him a subscription. He is a master of cinematics. I really need to be learning from him. Can I just say a special thank you to all my server friends who have taken this concept of Karen and really run with it. They're coming up with half the storylines themselves. I honestly didn't build that graveyard. I honestly didn't put up those signs, and I definitely didn't prank his house. I am loving where they're going with things and thank you so much.